Good morning, Raymond Temple. Today is Wednesday, August 11th, 2021. Guess who that is? That's right, that's me. When I was about your age in elementary school, I wanted to share this picture with you to remind you that we've all been where you are at and we all know how you might be feeling because we were all young once. I think I was in second or third grade right there. So we're going to start again today with a little bit of breathing and set our intention. So relax your jaw, make sure your tongue is off the roof of your mouth. Relax your belly. You can even put your hands on your belly and breathe with me. Now, look around and find one thing that you're grateful for. I'm grateful for Miss Emmerline, who is on the other side of this door. It's pretty late. She's still here because she's dedicated and wants to make sure that we have the best running school possible. So I'm grateful for Miss Emerly. How about you? All right, one intention. Remember that your intention is a goal that you have for the day. It doesn't have to be a great big goal. It could be a small goal. Maybe yesterday, some of our younger scholars cried a little bit. And so maybe your goal today is to try to use your words instead of your tears. For the older students, maybe you really didn't want to express how excited you were. And so maybe today you're going to be a little bit more honest with your friends, with your teacher, with yourself, and be okay with being happy at school. So set your intention. My intention is to be 100% ready for you tomorrow for our PBIS kickoff. All right, some announcements. For our lunch tables, we don't have to sit two by two. And so we gave it a try yesterday and the noon rec supervisors actually mr eli said you know what dr salas the kids really want to sit with their friends they really want to sit next to each other is there any way we can sit four to a table still gives them enough space and so because mr eli brought it up and he said that you would appreciate that we are going to allow four students to a table that way, it doesn't take as long to have you sit down. So you can thank Mr. Eli for um, changing that rule to four students at a table. Remember, we have both zones open, trying to see how that works out for everybody during lunch as well. We have both zones available for you to play. Tomorrow is our PBIS celebration. PBIS. What's that stand for? Well, it's not important for you to really know what each of those letters stands for. It really is important to know what it is. PBIS is every time we talk about soaring. It is how you act at school. It's what you say at school. It's the vibe that we have here at Raymond Temple. How we feel when we're here has a lot to do with 
everybody's actions and words. So PBIS kickoff is when we learn how to soar throughout the school. So tomorrow we have Cousin Danny from Happiness Is Now. I know one scholar was telling me that she wants to have a dance. So I hope she's gonna be dancing tomorrow. We are gonna have Cousin Danny in our first outdoor assembly, kick off our year with some positive mental attitude. Then we're going to have our PBIS kickoff, How to Soar, virtually. That's right. You're gonna join me in our first virtual assembly so that you can stay in your air-conditioned classrooms while I walk the campus and we talk about how to soar in different places. Now you already, most of you, except our new scholars, know how to soar. You know how to soar so well that you don't know this, but your school, Raymond Temple, earned the top medal for PBIS in the nation. PBIS is nationwide, and every year schools get to apply for a medal, like the Olympics. You can win a bronze, you can win a silver, you can win a gold, and they even have one more, more than the Olympics. They have the platinum. So, we earned one of those awards. Guess which one? That's right, the top one. Raymond Temple earned the Platinum Award for knowing how to soar. It's pretty awesome. We're gonna celebrate that tomorrow. Teachers, please check your schedule so that we can be ready for our PBIS Virtual Award for Cousin Danny to kick us off with positive mental energy. And then in the afternoon, we have a more serious talk about cyberbullying, harassment, and all the icky stuff that we want to make sure doesn't happen here in our house. So please check your schedule. Tomorrow's all about PBIS. All right, that's all I have for today. It's gonna be a great day, your second day of school, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.